Hey, what's going on Amazon sellers and hopefully soon to be Amazon sellers. So if you are not sure what this is, this is the training wheels product list. And this is something I do every seven to 14 days for all the members of Amazon FBA University. And what this is that I am literally sourcing products for you. These are products that you could go buy through the list of suppliers that we have in the program. However, maybe you're not feeling comfortable about making a purchase order or maybe you just are not used to the business right now and you just want to let me do it for you. So what I'm doing is I get a few list of products and I source it for you and these are first come first serve. So if you respond to saying, hey, I want these products and I want all of them right here. Whoever responds first, either a YouTube comment, a um, email or a message, whatever it is, it's first come first serve and you have to be a member. So if you're not a member, I will have a link right below in the description. It's going to be the first link that says Amazon FBA University like enrollment. If you join there, then you can actually buy these products. However, you have to be a member to get these products. And these are products that I would only personally sell. Okay, so it's not going to be any like leftover stuff. These are products that I would only personally sell and I'm going to be sourcing them for you through my connection to suppliers. However, you have access to those suppliers in the program, in the course, but I'll be doing this for you and be doing this every seven to 14 days. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going over the numbers. We're going over the products. I've been going over how much sell and all the profits involved with these products. So enough talking. I'm going to run the numbers on this and this might be a longer video because it takes a little bit of time to do each on the product because you definitely want to be make sure you're hitting the right numbers and everything. So I will be going over there. There's going to be four different products, all brand name stuff. And if there's something that you're restricted in, don't worry. I know there's going to be one product that's a restricted category um, or a restricted brand, but there's going to be no problem. We're able to get the invoices and the authorization from the guy. Already have had it done in my account that we get full access to go. And the rest of them, everyone can sell and do products. <laughs> Guys, these are going to be really good products. So I will be stop talking and let's get into this. So again, these are products only for the members only. It's first come, first serve. And if you are w wanting to become a member because you could get your investment back right away from getting these products, what you can do is go to AmazonFBAUniversity.com. It will take you to this page. You can go hit become a member now. Become a member. There is a fee of $9.97, um, but you get everything involved in there. And then also I will have a link right below, the first, thing, first link in the description that says Amazon FBA and University, and you can check and become a member. However, enough talking about that. Let's get into the numbers of these products, right? Because that's going to be the exciting thing. So the first product we're going to go over with, let's see what it is. So I have these four products. There's going to be 200 quantity of something with a minimum order quantity of 200, but that you can get 300 if you want. It's going to be a price of 105. The second product is going to be 64 total units, uh, price of 375. The uh, third one's going to be 32 units with a price of four bucks. Uh, the fourth ASIN is going to be 44 units with a price of $15.35. So let's go over to the first product and you'll probably like this one. So let's go into Amazon. And let's check it out. So go into here, and guys, um, this product is going to be have a brand restriction. However, no problem. Our supplier is able to get you fully ungated in that, and there's no problem at all. So don't worry about that because we've already had people get um, ungated with Apple and everything like that. So there's no problem. That's full authorization from Apple, who owns Beats. So there's no problem with that. However, selling for $159.99. Our cost is a dollar or a dollar five, one oh five, right? One hundred five dollars. So and we got two hundred of them. And so if we, what are we going to do, because I always tell you to check the ranks. So the one confusing thing with electronic category, the elect, it's the only thing for electronic category and Amazon, they don't tell publicly the reason why they do this. But if you go into the electronic category, you'll notice a lot that Amazon doesn't show the rank for the main category. Now I'm going to tell you right now, this sells really, really fast. And you can see there's been 3,000 uh, customer reviews. However, Amazon's not going to give data off this product. And that's just for the electronic category. So if, if for any other category, I know this does not make sense right now, but do not worry about this. Um, there's a ways to track manually to see how much this sells in a month. But I've calculated it's about over 500 that sells a month. However, what I've also done is I'm able to manually track it by doing a 999 card method. So earlier I tracked this and this guy had, I think, like 70 or something. I'll check what it is. And now I'll see how much he has right now. But I was checking it and we're getting about 500 sales per month off this product. Okay. So I know it make, might not make sense right now with other stuff I do. However, there's going to be about 500 sales off this product per month that you'll be getting. So we're looking at less than a one month supply. We'll be sharing the buy box and everything, but there's not a lot of people. So if I go in here and I plug in 999, right? Okay, so earlier this guy actually had 77 of them, and that was like literally 45 minutes ago. So like it sells about 500 a month, guys. With the electronic category, it's very confusing, so you can't really check exactly the sales. But now let's go check our, our profits involved with this product. So let's go into there, and then so, and then also with this, you can't use Keepa for some odd reason. As you can notice, Keepa is not going to uh, load up, but that's just going to be different for this product, just because it's an electronic thing. Amazon does not disclose information off 
really fast selling electronic stuff and there's they just don't tell why so that's just how you have to deal with it however it's a fast moving product but let's go over but we will be able to check out the profits okay so you're not gonna be going completely blind but the good thing is we have a very low amount of quantity to work with so we'll sell out fast okay so I'm gonna go into current and new Amazon fulfillment because starting October 1st Amazon will have different uh, fees mostly for their storage fees however um, oh and also guys if you didn't know um, if you currently have some inventory on Amazon they are doing free removal orders for a very short amount of time so, so you can remove your products uh, for free right now. But um, it does if you want to get back to your house. That might not make sense. I'll try to keep it simple. However, Amazon fulfillment current. So our price is one fifty nine ninety nine. Our cost is one hundred five. I'm not going to do anything to ship to Amazon fee right now. It's going to be insignificant, right? If you've seen any other videos, you understand it's insignificant. So we realize. Um, so if we sold them today, we'd make thirty dollars and fifty four cents. If we sell them on October first and beyond, it's going to be. $30.50. So that's pretty good. We're looking at like a 30% ROI. So I'm gonna put that down right here is we're gonna get 500 sales a month, right? Um, but we are gonna share that with other people. So if I go back to here, there are gonna be other people who are selling. It says 89, but those 89, none of them are gonna actually be getting the buy box. So all of these people selling it as used, they're not getting it, right? Not at all. And these guys, um, these products are new, brand new with full retail, full warranty and everything. It has the year warranty exactly how you would buy it when you go buy to Best Buy, right? So then I'm gonna go to new. And uh, so we're gonna realize there's only one, two, three. And the good thing is right now, Amazon sharing the buy box. So they do share the buy box off this product because they don't have a huge amount of inventory, but um, they are sharing the buy box off this product. And it looks like we're only gonna care about these three people. So we'll look at, and this person's back ordered right now. So if we got 500 sales per month, we're looking at, we'd be the fourth, that's 120. So we're looking at a less than two month supply if you buy 200 of these, right? So. I would say it's gonna be on the low end you get 120 so we say 120 sales per month perfect product coming into the holidays that you would sell out and everything like that so the gross sales um, what we're gonna be getting at is gross sales so right here we realize a gross sale for selling one product is gonna be $135 and we're gonna go off the October 1st okay so $135 but now we realize say if you buy 200 right your gross sales will be um, Twenty-seven thousand dollars, and your net profit is going to be six thousand one hundred. So pretty good, right? So now what we're going to go over with is actually the one twenty, which is the how much you could be doing per month off this. So one twenty would be if we go into here, zoom in, it's going to be sixteen grand in gross sales and three thousand six hundred in uh, net profit. So I'm going to go back to the two hundred. Let's say if you bought two hundred, the minimum order quantity is two hundred. We're going to go put our numbers into there. And so what we realize is so gross sales is gonna be twenty seven grand one one four. So I'm gonna put that in there. So twenty seven one 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 four. The net profit right would be six thousand one hundred forty four. And you guys don't have to buy three hundred. I kind of would recommend starting out with two hundred right because we can end up go getting more. However, um, that's just gonna be good to go. So six thousand one hundred fourteen is the net profit one one. Four. I'm gonna put a comma there. One, one, four. And now let's figure out our net profits or our ROI. So our ROI, right? It's gonna be this thirty dollars and fifty cents divided by this, because we're getting an extra thirty dollars and fifty cents by spending one hundred five. So let's figure out what that is. Go calculator. We are gonna go. So we are get, profiting thirty dollars, right? Thirty point five seven, and you're gonna divide that by one hundred five. Okay because it's gonna be 105 plus 30 that you're getting. So we're getting 29.1% ROI off this product. So pretty solid, right? That's pretty, like, you're not gonna be able to get Dr. Dre Beats for anywhere else cheaper. Just letting you know that right now. Like, you're not gonna, that's, you're, you're not gonna get Dr. Dre Beats for cheaper than that. So 29% ROI, um, yeah, I mean, that's probably higher in ROI than probably Best Buy is making, to be brutally honest, I bet you, Best Buy is probably making 25% ROI, so we're gonna be making more than Best Buy, which is pretty cool, right? Um, but so that's the first product right there. First come, first serve if you want the Dr. Dre Beats. Now, that's gonna be a bigger uh, purchase order, so that's gonna be more if you have a lot more capital. Uh, these next three products are gonna be very low amount um, purchase. It's gonna be a really high ROI, but like this is gonna be great if you don't have a lot of capital right now or wanna buy some products, because that might be intimidating, like, oh wow, I gotta be spending quite a bit of money, right? However, um, these next products are going to be like, okay, if you just want to start out with a couple hundred dollars, start with like a thousand bucks, easy to go. So this first product we're going to go, so the next product, it's going into it and it's going to be, I'm um, keep that other tab open. 
So we'll just figure out what this item is. So this item is going to be some, uh, what's it called, as seen on TV products. I believe this was the extra large one. Yes, so it's the extra large one. I'm going to make sure to double check the ASIN, right? Because there are other ones. So yeah, so it's the extra large one, 30,294 in sports and outdoors. And we're able to check the history off this product. And so if you're confused when I was talking about earlier that I can't calculate the rank buy into sales per month, we can calculate it here, right? So 3294, I'm going to open up a tool called Jungle Scout slash Estimator, free to use. And we are going to go to the responding category, which I believe they said sports and outdoors. Let's go double check that. Sports and outdoors, and we're going to get 3294. And we're going to copy that. Yeah, I mean, you don't have to copy, you can just type it in. I usually just type it in. And go 30. Two nine four. So eighty six of these sell per month. We have you have sixty four. You can go buy. So if we're looking, if we're the only person in the buy box, that's a less than a month. Um, however, let's go now. Figure out how many other sellers there are in the buy box. So if we go into here, there's new. There's six people selling it. That one person. This person's got four left in stock. Um, this person. So there's only two other people, right? So this person did have four left in stock. Let's actually just double check that. So let's go add to cart. And I'll go add to cart for this one as well. Okay. So if we go into here, um, I'm going to move my face a little bit. Let's go to cart. And so that, okay, that's cool. That's pretty cool. This person's got six left in stock and the other one's got four. So you're really, once the items get in there, they're going to sell out and you're going to be the only one on the buy box. So this is going to take about a month to sell out. So I'm just going to plug in what we actually have sales per month is 86. However, we only have 64, so I'll just type in 64 sales per month because that's all you're going to be getting. So now let's go figure out, actually first let's go check out the history of this product, right? Because it's important to check out history. Um, I know we weren't able to check with the Beats, but Beats sell fast. They have been selling all along, huge big brand name. Um, but let's go, so let's wait for Keep It to Populate, and it's loading, so let's just let that populate. And okay, so now what we're going to be looking at, it's been selling for 183 days. If we look at the past three months, um, this was a new product. So when a product, like because it's been up for six months, when the product first comes up, the rank's going to be very bad. But then when there starts getting offers, then their uh, rank's going to be going faster. So I saw that it was at 39,000, went up to 91,000, and went down, then back down to 30. So it's been kind of staying around right here, basically where it started as, the 30,000, and went from there. So that's pretty good. I mean, even if it got to 65,000, or got to 40,000 or it's probably still selling. So if I say if I go 65,000, right? So it's still selling 25 a day at the worst case, right? So here, this is a pretty solid product to go by. It's still selling pretty consistent. It's a new product as well, or not a new product. It's been selling for six months. It's as seen on TV. So when it's an as seen on TV product, that's why you see ups and downs because when a commercial comes by, right? When people are doing the advertising for you, they'll start selling more. When there is no commercials, then they start going up. However, it's an as seen on TV product this will sell pretty fast for you. So that's good to know that the history is good. So now let's go check out the ASIN to figure out our profits, right? Because if we figured out our price was, what was our price? Our price was 375. Okay, 375 is our cost. Now let's go pull up a different fee calculator or a separate window. We have a lot of windows open after this lesson or after this video. So going to here, I just plugged in something totally different. Um, okay, I'm going to repaste that in. Okay, so what I want to get is this ASIN. Okay, so this ASIN, and now we're going to go in to paste it in. And we're looking at the extra large one, not the small medium one. So now what we're going to do is going to go to current and new fulfillment, and we are going to plug in the current buy box, which is $17. And shipped Amazon fee, not going to do anything for that right now. It's going to be insignificant. Um, $375 is our cost. All right. So we profit $7.66. So that's pretty good. That's over 200% ROI. Pretty solid, guys. So our gross sales off one product is $11.41. $11 and net profit is $7.66. So you put $3.75 in. You profit seven dollars and 66 so that three dollars and 75 cents gets turned into eleven dollars and 41 cents pretty cool okay and we have a total of was it 64 66 64 so our gross sales will be 
um, seven hundred and thirty dollars, and our net profits be four hundred and ninety dollars. That's that's solid, guys. So seven thirty. So you can see totally different than the first product that you're not spending like twenty grand. However, we got people that are like that, so that want to spend that money, and make more money. However, let's go into this product where it's it's a lot less, but uh, we're looking at seven thirty, right, and twenty four cents for our gross sales, and four ninety was our net profit. Four ninety twenty four. Okay, so net profit is four ninety twenty four. Let's calculate our ROI, which is going to be the 375 divided by our net profit, right? So it's going to be this number divided by that number. Pull that calculator up. So 3.75 divided by 7.66. And looking at four, I did that the wrong way. It's going to be 7.66. Divide by because our profit so you divide your profit by your cost of product. So divide that. Uh, I gotta redo that. So seven point six six divided by three point seven five. Okay, is two point zero four, which is two hundred four percent. So the the calculation I did before, make sure you don't do that when you're calculating. That would be the inverse of it. So that means like if we spent seven dollars and sixty six cents and profited three seventy five. In this case, we profited three seventy five. Where we Spent 375 and profited 7.6. So our ROI is 204%. Okay, so that's pretty solid. Well, let's plug that in. That might be the biggest ROI we've seen on these training wheel product lists, right? So you spend not a lot of money and it turns into $730 and a profit of 490. And I'm gonna put our total, like, so if you bought all this stuff, right? Um, say we're gonna do the minimum order quantity of 200, we'll put it like your total investment, right? And then your like total output would be the gross sales. So I'll go put total investment in here right now. Total invest. I'll just go to total invest. So if we go back to the beats, which was 200 times 105, that's going to be 21 grand. So your total investment is $21,000. And then, but that $21,000 would get turned into $27,000, which is pretty solid. There's not a lot of things that can do that. That's if you got more money. So this case, it's gonna be um, the second product's gonna be 64 times 3.75. So you look at 3.75 times 64, 240 bucks. So your total investment is $240, quite different than the other one, and it turns into $730. That's I I hope you think that's good. I really hope you think so. Um, yeah, <laughs> I really hope you do. But uh, so then the next one, let's go four times 32, which I should be that 64 one. Is that 128? All right. Let me calculate that. Uh, times 32. Hey, 128. I dropped out of college and I still know math. 128. And then the second and the last one is going to be 44 times 15.75. Okay. So that's $693 for the last one. 693. And then now I'm going to put just total, total of total. It's gonna be the total like investment of all of them. I'm gonna calculate all those up right now. I usually do this at the end, but I'm just gonna do this right now to see what our biggest investment would be. So 21. And guys, okay, okay, let me stop you right here. So with these products, like if you just buy the beats, you can just buy the beats, but um, you can't just buy like one unit of like that uh, thing that we just went over, this belt thing, this woman belt thing. You can't just buy like five units of that and just five units of the beats. You're gonna to have to buy either all of the like belt things or all of the beats. You don't have to. So like when I say 64 units, you're going to have to buy all 64 units. You can't buy just 32 of them, but you don't have to buy everything. So if you just buy the belt thing, you don't have to go buy the beats. Okay. I hope that makes sense that like you just have to buy one of these. You don't, but like with the beats, the beats is a different scenario. So you can go buy a hundred of them if you want to. However, we're keeping it capped at 300. So you don't have to like buy everything. You just, I'm just putting the total. If you like the total just for our group, right, is going to be Let's go calculator. There's a lot of calculations. Plus 240. Plus 128. This is the only math you need in life. Plus 693. It'd be $22,061. 22, uh, $22, so 22,061. And most of that just comes from the beats. The other 1,061 comes from the other stuff. So now we know what our total uh, is. Now let's go total um, profit. And we'll, we're calculating that right now. So. Next product, right? So first come, first serve. If you wanted that last belt thing, go for it. If you wanted the beats, go for it. Um, message me, Facebook, message or 
YouTube comment or, I mean, YouTube comments probably fine or uh, email bellcodmarketing at gmail.com. So now let's open up another tab and let's go into this. So we go, boom, put in that ASIN and our third pro, did I type? That doesn't make sense. Um, okay, that's that's weird. Maybe, oh, why was there a Z in there? Is that just me or what? Did I see a Z? Okay, yep, this is the proc. I don't I don't know what I did there, but I must have put in the wrong ASIN. Okay, so this is a auto thing, automobile like pro, uh, product, and you should be ungated in automotive. How, if, it, if you aren't, it's very, very simple, and just let me know we can get ungated in that like <laughs> within a few hours. Um, it's like automated that you get on gated in. However, so this $13.12, it's an HD visor for your car, right? So you put it in there. Um, it's whatever it is. It's an automobile thing as seen on TV. So let's go figure out the rank first, which is, ooh, looks like Keepa's looking good for us. So Keepa's been pretty consistent, right? Um, the rank ranges a little bit from when the price goes a little higher, it gets a little up. But um, it's staying consistently at that 20000 range, 25000 so that's still good. Now, so we just went over the Akiba. Akiba looks good. Um, this is also another product that Amazon will share the buy box. A lot of people say Amazon won't share the buy box. Yes, they will, guys. They're sharing the buy box right here. It depends on the products, but right now Amazon's sharing the buy box. So we're good to go on this product. So now I'm going to go figure out the rank. And I like it when Amazon's sharing the buy box because they keep the market price, right? So the rank is 12404 in automo automotive. So if we go into automotive, automotive. And we go 12404. That's going to be 131 sales per month. And we're looking at we have 32 of them. So depending on how many other people in the buy box, go check that out. Um, see what, like how fast this turnaround will be. So if we go and there's 11 other people selling, but again, not 11 are going to have the buy box, right? So we're going to filter out to prime and we're going to filter out to new. Filter out to new. And realize we're going to have one, two, three guys in or three girls or three sellers in the buy box so now we would be the fourth and they're all sharing it right now so we would be the fourth so we're going to get these sales divided by four which if we go 120 divided by four that's three so we're looking at a one month supply so i'm going to put that you're going to get 32 sales in a month off this product because we have 32 of them so we realize the history is good the sales are good now we just gotta make sure it's profitable and our cost is four bucks so in selling for 13 i think we're gonna have a chance to be profitable on here so let's go into the ASIN. I think I already have it copied it, but I'm going to copy it again. Now let's go to FBA fee calculator. Let's go figure out these profits and go from there. So then paste in here. I want, whoops, so I want to also go for the current and new Amazon fulfillment centers. So what's it called? So price was $13.12. Um, our cost was 4 bucks. So plug in 4 $3.35, so it's actually pretty cool. Amazon's fulfillment, or their like fees are actually being lower. You're actually making more money October 1st, so don't sell them this September. I'm just kidding, but um, yeah, so just right there. So make $3.35 off by spending four bucks. So this will be a little under 100% ROI. <laughs> that's good. Like, if you can end with 20% ROI, guys, that's amazing, especially for this type of product. So and we realize there's 32 sales um, a month that we're going to be getting. So the gross sales is going to be $235 and the net profits can be 107 and 20 cents. So if we go into here now, we got 235.20. So 235 and 20, so $235 and our net profit is 107, $107 and 20 cents. So $107 and 20 cents. And now let's go figure out our ROI. I like figuring out our ROI. So and it's going to be three. It's going to be 335 divided by 4. You get the profit divided by the your cost, your total investment, okay? So right here we go. 3.35 divided by 4 is going to be 83% ROI, 83.75. So going here, let's just go round it down to 83%. So 83% ROI, total investment is 128, and that 128 gets turned into 235 bucks. Pretty solid, right? Uh, a little more than $100, $100 net profit, $107.20. So that's third product. First come, first serve. You email me at bowcloudmarketing at gmail.com. <laughs> Message or comment down below on this YouTube video or just contact me anyway. And if you're not a member yet, you're going to have to go to AmazonFBUniversity.com, become a member, check out, pay the fee, and go from there. 
So now we have the last product, right? Almost down the end. It's been like 20 something minutes right now. Okay, so we got 44 quantity and the price is 1575. So we can go into Amazon, put up another tab. I told you we're going to have a lot of tabs open. Paste in the ASIN. And it's Mario and Luigi. Okay, cool, Mario and Luigi. So we're looking at the video game, Nintendo 3DS Mario and Luigi Dream Team. I um, again, if you're ungating this or not getting this, no problem. Get ungated, no problem, within very fast amount of time because we're working with authorized suppliers, right? Pretty cool. So $29.95. Let's go figure out the rank first. Ranks 2666 in video games. Oh, that's haunted. Uh, so 2666 in video games. Let's figure out what that is per month. 266 is 91 sales per month. All right. So we have 44 of them. So if we're the only one in the buy box, it's going to sell out within a couple weeks. But let's go check out the other people in the buy box. I know this is very repetitive, guys, but it's, it's simple. I like to keep it very, very simple. So it's very simple for you guys to go do this, right? If you're going to go private label, there's a lot of other variables. And the great guys, the, I'm going to stop you right here. The great thing about these products is there's no other variables. There is simply no other variables with this product. And it's just this is how you're getting the numbers. So look here, the rank has gone up a little bit. But if we look at the rank only went up to like, 3,500, right? So it's pretty fast moving. It's in the summer and everything like that. But once it gets down into the uh, whatever months, it's been at like at 500 before. So, I mean, even if it's at the like 3,500 3, it's been at before, that's still fast moving. So the rank looks like a big, but it's still 69. So the worst case is going to sell 69 a month. Um, that's cool. So now, Okay, cool. There's one person at $39.99 and one person at $29.95. So we realize, worst case, we get 69 sales a month, but right now it's at 266. And really, guys, it's coming the holidays, coming fourth quarter. They're going to be selling more. So 91 sales per month. If we divide that by two, because we would be the second person in the buy box, we're going to get, it's going to be less than a month's supply, right? Because 44 times two is 88. So it's going to be less than a month. So we're gonna, like, you're going to get 44 within that month's time. Now, you're told, now let's go figure out our gross sales, all right? Let's try to make this exciting. So let's go to get the ASIN, right? I think I already have it copied, but let's go into it right now. I'm gonna go copy the ASIN. Come on, copy the ASIN. Let's put up another fee calculator. We're almost, guys, we're, on, we're almost done here. So FBA fee revenue calculator. It's very simple to follow. I like to make this very simple, no variables. Just you see the product and boom, you're done. So uh, $29.95 is our or what it's selling for, and our cost of product is $15.75. And guys, everything, I'm, all these products I'm showing you, brand new, full authorization. You're able to go have full rights to sell these products, or you're good to go. So $15.75, we're going to calculate, make $5.51 off each sale. So that's pretty good. We're looking at, what, under 39% or 30% ROI? Let's go figure that out um, second. But So we have 44 of them, so 44. We realize that's going to come out to be, in gross sales, $935. So $935 is the gross sales. $935, and what was it, $0.44? Cents? $0.44, cents. good memory. $0.44. Cents. Maybe I should put dollar signs on these. Yeah, let's go put dollar signs on all of these guys so you understand what these are. They're just numbers, like sales. So dollar sign. I should have put like a dollar like emoji on it. Dollar 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 put a comma there because you got one comma right there so put a dollar dollar and i believe our net profit let's look into this is 242 dollars and 44 cents so put a dollar sign 242 right 242 and 44 cents 242 and 44 cents um and then our roi let's figure that out all right, I think we're close to hitting 30 minutes already on this video. So let's go. So it's awesome if you're staying watching this because you know you want to make money. If you come on, you guys got 30 minutes a day, make some good money. That's good to go. So not a lot to do in this business. Um, so what was I doing? Yeah, oh yeah, net profit or ROI. Put the calculator again. We're gonna look at our cost of product is. So we're gonna go 551 divided by the 1575 because you divide your profit by your cost of product. Divided by 1575, which comes out to be $34 or just under 35% ROI. I'm going to round up to 35% ROI. So it's 
So 35% ROI off this product. You spend a total of 693 and it turns into 935. So now let's go figure out our total, total profit with this. So our total investment, right? Is me, I'm gonna put another dollar sign on this. So dollar sign, put a comma in there. And our total profit, we said we're gonna add up our total profit right here. That doesn't have a dollar sign. So, okay, it doesn't give us a dollar sign, I guess. All right, so calculate, and we are going to figure out our total net profit with all this good stuff right here. So pull up the calculator again. It went away from me. So we're going to get 6,144, uh, no, 6,114 plus 490 plus 107 plus 242. Now i got to go plus the cents plus 44 plus 0.2 plus 0.24 so our total profit is six thousand nine hundred fifty three dollars and eighty eight cents so if you want to join the program thousand bucks to join the program we have six thousand nine hundred fifty three dollars in profit right here that you can get um however like these are products that you can go source yourself in the program so i'm sourcing them these guys for you however like you see these products right here there's at least, like, I would honestly say probably at least a thousand times as much as this, like, every single day, right? Because there's 500 authorized suppliers. Each of these products is one product from one supplier, right? And they have so many more of these all the time. This is a very, very small amount. So, like, and you guys have been in the program, you understand there's products coming and coming out all the time. So, this is, like, very, this is literally, like, that much of, like, what it's actually, like, in the, like, what you can actually get. So, you can source it yourself and source... 10, 20, 30, 50 times as much as this, like no problem. And do the math on that, just, just 10x everything. It's very simple. So our total profit is going to be 6,953 and 88 cents. So 6,953 and 88 cents is the net profit off this training wheel product list number four. First come, first serve, guys. So if you're not a member yet, you do have to become a member. I join Amazon FBA University or Amazon FBA University .com. Go to become a member. You're good to go. If you are a member right now, it's first come, first serve. Message me, comment on this YouTube video. That's be very easy to comment on the YouTube video or uh, email me at bowconmarketing.com and we'll get these products out to you as soon as possible and we'll go from there. So these are awesome, guys. Hope you guys have a great day. And if you have not um, seen any of my videos or if you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel yet, you're going to want to make sure you do that. And I also, if you guys don't want to become a member at all, I do have a open Facebook group that you guys can join, Amazon FBA University. There is a private group that everyone's already in for the members, but this is a public Facebook group. Guys, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Make sure to comment on it. Make sure to share it. Do whatever you want with it. Comment down below, seeing if you like these videos and everything. So I hope you guys have a great day and hope you like this video.